I don't know. Probably gonna run away though. Not feeling the best either. A little bit better. And we'll litter. You are a genius. No, but I can ride a horse. Well, in my world, that makes you a genius. You're too kind. <laughs> So how are the uh, photos coming along? What? How many oh, different hats I'm going to be wearing through this? I have a print of the wolves before they try to eat us. Hmm. It's for you. That's real fun. Well, thank you. Take care, Mr. Mason. You too, sir. You too. Now for a few final checks. Well, am I able to ride that horse? Come on now, boy. I wanted to capture it. Yeah. Oh, they're gone. Never mind. All right, let's get back to town. Let's go to the Emerald Branch. Never mind. No, I don't. I want to be here. Thanks. I lied. Yep. And I could probably take the train. Oh, I passed it by. Stagecoach is there. I just missed the sign. Go, go, boy. Oh, no! Stage coach is right there. Not sure how I missed that. Yeah. Let's take a ride. Get a ride, please, partner. So where you need to be? We are going to Rhodes. Rhodes, please. No destination too close. What the same horse like Dutch has. It's in the snow. Oh. Yeah. Alright. I haven't been anywhere well, besides the beginning. I don't think I've really done anything in the snow area. Can we bathe at the hotels? So I am one filthy dude. Vacancies. No. This damn place. Paper. Well, maybe there isn't. Maybe there isn't. Saloon, maybe. Or do I just... Oh, it says no vacancies. Or does it just clean when I shave? Oh, 
Just head back. Looking to sell your wares or buy some of the finest meat? I don't think you got any idea about the land you walk in, do you? What us raiders gave for it. I've seen folk like you before. Always the first to run screaming. I can really run screaming, buddy. Who are you, Charles? Arthur, dumbass. Get back, Arthur. <laughs> yeah. Alright, so we're gonna sell some stuff at our camp here. Put some stuff away. Hey, Arthur. Yeah, we don't have much fun. down you busy Arthur yes what do you think of the place I don't know so far it seems okay I guess I think that there is rich pickings for some carpet baggers like us is that what we are is it avenging your father's death after 30 years there's gold, Bart. Gold. Gold. If you say so. Hey, Arthur. What's going on? Jose and John are looking for you. They went out to the moonshine stash, said you knew where that was. They was planning a visit to the Braithwaite place, but John needs to do something for Dutch now, so Hosea wants you to join him instead. Seems to be a lot going on. You're telling me. Fishing mission, okay. Okay, thank you. Alright, then we'll get alright. E. Nope. Hip. Hip. Get it. Nope. There we go. Okay. Let's contribute. Let's just get rid of all the watches and stuff. Uh, good item. It's not tons of money out of this, is it? It'll add up. Oh, why, why did I stop? This is worth five. Why you give up? No, 
I'm not sure why I keep popping out here. Okay. Perfect. So we got $215 in here. Or $20. Uh, let's look at the ledger. See if we can do anything for upgrading. I don't know if we need any food or anything. So we get the good stuff. Potent health cures and tonics. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, so that's all upgraded. Let's have some fun. Fire bottles and high velocity repeater ammo. Eight. It's got a chicken coop, camp boat. We have a boat. Didn't we just steal one? What should we call him? Well, he's a wanderer. Let's do the ammo. Something bad. His name is Kane. Okay. Hey, Kane. What are you wearing? <laughs> Thinking of switching to the other toys? <laughs> All right. So I don't have much money, but you know what? Let's donate some money. So I can do some more upgrades. Oh, you can only give so much to the box. Oh, all right. Um, let's do neat. Let's shave, shower, and s well, I don't know about shower, but shave and sleep. How you gentlemen keeping? Fine, Miss Grimshaw. Mm -hmm. finger fillet, Mica. Is this thing gonna be like what it is on uh, Alien? My bad. A little scruffy. Do that. Let's just go to sleep. Get up in the morning. Uh, yeah, sleep in the morning. You'll look at her all day. Doesn't matter what I say, you'll believe whatever fantasy you're currently living in. I <laughs> <laughs> uh, see what Jose has. <clears throat> Had to reinstall your Red Dead because I got the series. Oh, okay. Yeah, I've had this game for like about the time I started my channel. And I played like, oh, I don't know, 15 minutes of it. I'm like, oh, I'm going to save this for a stream. And then I uh, put it off. I think I kind of forgot about it, too. Wait, where was he at? Where, um, way over there. 
Never mind. We'll go to Bill. To Sean, too. We gotta look like a side quest to Rob. House. What is it? We got something cooking you might be interested in. Am I gonna like the sound of this? Been cooking since Horseshoe. But you went and kicked up all that commotion in Valentine. Now, we was preparing to rob the bank there until you got involved in all that nonsense, and I don't know, I just feel like it's unfinished business. That wasn't my fault. It was just one of them things. Now, how come every time I get in trouble, I'm called a fool and an idiot? But when you get in trouble, oh, it's just one of them things. <laughs> That's a good point, Arthur. A very good Lenny. point. All right, well, what do y'all want me to do? Hit the goddamn bank with us. <laughs> you really think it's worth going back there? Four of us can hit the bank easy, but I ain't gonna lie to you. There will be law if we linger. And if we're serious? No, just local boys being rounded up and pressed into action. Meaning? If we go in quick and quiet, we can hit it just fine. If there's four of us, I mean. Y'all think it's worth the risk? It's a bank, Arthur. So? Is the take... Good. According to the fella I met, yes. It's the end of the stock sales. Plenty of money and plenty of people milling about. <sighs> okay. I suppose. It's worth taking a look at least. I'm gonna be performing. I better go get changed out of these rags. <clears throat> Give me a minute, gentlemen. Okay. So, Bill, this better be good. It is good. We put a lot of research into this one. I hope so. Mr. Morgan. Herr Strauss? That man. The debtor, Thomas Downs, apparently he's dead. Dead? Huh. Well, no, he didn't seem very well. His wife. I believe he has a wife and child. She will assume the debt, of course. Of course. Then you can head up there and collect. He lent them a lot of money. Okay. Gentlemen, let's go rob ourselves a bank. What's the plan, then? Oh, well, we're gonna send Karen on in ahead as a uh, distraction. Then we're just gonna rush on in afterwards. Just a All small right. bank in a little town. Nothing that big in way of security. We just need to bring you along as a insurance policy. Yeah, that sounds about right. Okay, let's move out. Uh, gonna run the Valentine? That's gonna be a long run. It's gonna go wrong. Oh, it can go wrong. Anything can once the shooting starts. Well, that's reassuring. Like I said, we'll see how it looks. If we can get in all right, we'll send Miss Jones ahead to the bank. They won't recognize her. I'll show you boys how it's done. What are you thinking this time? I don't know. Fellers always like the lost little girl, but nobody plays a drunken harlot boy like me. Need <laughs> should work. Once she's got them distracted, we'll move in. When I was scouting the place the other day, there was only a couple of guards. We deal with them and any customers who are feeling brave. And you always fancy yourself as the vault man, right, Arthur? Now I see why you brought me. Hey, I'm more than willing. <laughs> uh, best I do it. Oh, and did Dutch tell you I've also been cooking up some deals with them gray boys? What? No. What kind of deals? See, you don't realize, Morgan. I'm out there putting in the work same as you. I've been drinking with them a couple times now. Seems they're looking for some extra security. Yeah, I'm sure they are. Could be something in it for us. Well... Just be smart about it. We got a lot of irons in that fire right now. Yes. Go with Harlot? Alright. Can't believe you got me going back to Valentine. Don't tell me it ain't hurt you leaving that bank behind. Not really. Work 
every town and not hit the bank? <laughs> That's downright pathetic. I guess we went a bit beyond working it. We shot the place to hell. Yeah, we you did. You did, Morgan. Not me. Strawberry, I too. It cool up there. Couple of punch ups. Dealt with some old Driscolls. Ah, oh, is that right? Like I said, you mess up is just one of them things. I mess up. I'm the prize idiot. Well, Bill, I don't know what to tell you. Surprised you ain't already ripped me about that dynamite again. One mistake, and I'll never live it down. What do you need? Pat on the back. Love which plays role? Oh, okay. Just know, I got the lead on this one. We'll see about that once things get going. I have a feeling this is going to go all sorts of wrong. So, thinking this through. Rob Cornwall's train. We shoot a heap of his men in Valentine. We rob his stagecoach. Yep. This is just dawning on you now. And now, we're going back to the one place he knew where to find us. That's a genius of him. Folk never look at what's right under their nose. I ain't sure that's always true. What's happened to you? You're getting real nervy in your old age. The last few weeks happened. Forget about Cornwall. He can't have many men left at this point. Got a bit hairy in that barn, but we all walked away fine from that. Yeah, he does have a lot of men. Four of us could deal with them in Valentine, and four of us could deal with them after the coach robbery. I ain't too worried. If you say so. We need to move quick once we're in Valentine. I'm sure they ain't forgotten us. Of course. In and out. Dutch is going to love this. Let's get it done first. Keep it down now. Well, I paid for, for my bounty, so... You're good, right? <laughs> they ran him over. Good job, Benny. Keep it cool and follow me, fellers. I'll follow you. So, we never decided. Is it lost little girl you want or the drunken harlot? Uh, the harlot. Uh, of course, you know I like the harlot. You're the only one. You're a bunch of filthy sinners and the heartbreakers, Zolotia. <laughs> now, where is he? If you're ready, get going. Good luck, gentlemen. 
We got this. Oh no! All right, I don't have my handgun. Okay, we're going. No, hold on. Wait till she's gotten real dead. Uh, how do I quick pull? Oh, there. Not so goddamn stuck up last night. Oh, sorry. This is too much. I've never seen this woman in my life. Get your goddamn right. hands up! Go. This is a goddamn robbery! Nobody move! No word up! Nobody move! Don't make us hurt you! Here! Unlock the door! Okay, the door's unlocked. Oh, you think we're here? Oh, 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 you better get that door open right now. I'm nearly there. Too goddamn slow! Beat it up! Son of a bitch, hurry up! Come on! I feel if I beat him too much, I'm gonna I'm gonna knock him out or kill him. Okay. himself in here come here <clears throat> open the lock boxes now I, I the, the, the manager does that I god damn it now what guess I'll crack them or blow them up keep an eye out I'll be as quick as I can reckon I'm gonna have to blow them oh god yeah we're in Valentine we gotta move before they blow oh the law will be all over us. Now you shut the hell up and be still. Blowing the doors. Yeah, they won't hear this at all. You're going to blow up? They're gonna blow up. There we go. How are you getting on? Wow, that's a decent Going amount of money. As fast as I can. Turn around. I'll keep a lookout at the door. Plant it. Take it way too long. Nothing? You don't want me to loot? What? Oh, uh, bug. Be fine just over here, right? Arthur Morgan Gaming Red Dead Redemption 2 playthrough part 6. 